Christmas everybody. Yep, here we are back again. And Samara's got herself a new grade. She's now a yellow belt, black tip. <laughs> okay, so now she needs to do the fourth queue requirements for green belt. Okay, because from there she wants to go to green belt. As I've said in previous videos, I'm not going to, hopefully I don't need to fix up fatal problems with your stances and anything from previous grades you should know that already if you don't go back to the uh, tenth queue um, video and have a look at that and you can fix yourself up okay so uh, the first one again we're going to start off with is the eddy geckles again similar to the previous one it's uh, ura and kaitan ura but this time we're doing it with kicks Okay, so here we go. Then put the dachi, get armor, I oi. Come on, tip. And now we're going to come through again. Ura, so that, like the previous game, exactly the same. So this one should be easier because you've learnt the Ura movement. So this back leg goes around this way. But now for this one here, we're going to do the kicks. So actually, Okay, kick. So just have your hands, I should start off in Zinkuzadachi, Juju Uki, just in this position here. And so this one, when you do the circle, get a circle, go all the way back around to where you come from. And then do the front kick, okay? And then back. And then when we go, the Kaitan Ura, so this one here goes around that way. So it goes around that way. And then we use that back leg again to kick the kick there. Okay, this. so we'll start that again. So uh, go to Zenko Tadachi, Jujuki, down like this. So the first one we're going to do is May, is a uh, uh, May Giri. Okay, May Giri. So Uro May Giri. Ready and itch. All the way around, that's it. She does the kick. And there, again, her hands are under control, they're not waving all over the place. And knee, around, and May Giri step forward. So once she's come all the way around the back to where she was started from, she does the May Giri and then she steps forward. Okay, and San, May Giri, and step forward. Okay, now we go Kaitan Ura, so same as the last, the, the other grade. This foot comes around this way, and then when it comes around, the back foot does the kick. Ready, and itch. So back. This foot that way and knee. Kick and back. Just skip forward a little bit. And that foot that way, son. Kick and back. Okay, very good. So the next one we do is the Kiyagi. So we'll go Mei Kiyagi, Uchi, um, Soto Mawashi and Uchi Mawashi. Okay, Mei. Soto and Uchi Mawashi Kiyagi. Okay, ready? And Ura. Itch. All the way around where she comes from. Mei Kiyagi, Soto, and Uchi. And step forward. So once you've done them, you step forward. And knee. All the way around where you started. Three Kiyagis. One, Soto, two, Uchi, three, and step forward. And San. All the way around to where you started. Three Kiyagis, one Soto, Uchi, and step four. Now we go Kaitan Ura, exactly the same as the first one. Front leg comes around and itch. Mei Kiyagi, Soto, Uchi. So it's exactly the same as the Mei Giri one. The back leg is the one that does, does the kicks. So this one comes around, then it does the kicks. And knee. Rikiyagi's one, Soto, Uchi. And back. You've already moved back at the stage, so you don't need to move again. And San. And I'm going to think I missed something there. Oh, Megiri Yashirugi. Okay. Um, so the next one we're going to do, I'll miss this one out, is. Same as the first one, we're going to go Mei Giri there and Ishiro Giri there. Okay, ready? Uh, ura. Yep. And so back leg comes around and Ura. Itch. Mei Giri. Back kick. Ishiro Giri. And step forward. Knee. Come around. Where you come from. Mei Giri. Ishiro Giri. Step forward. 
So one of the problems is you forget to step forward with this one, okay? So remember, when you come all the way around, you come all the way back to where you were. So when you, you haven't stepped forward yet, okay? And sun, back with leg around, all the way around, back to where you were. May giri, shiro giri, and forward. Now, kaitanura, now with this one, when you move, you've already moved your foot back. So you're not going to back where you come from, so you've already moved back, so you just move back to it. Ready? And itch. May giri, shiro giri, and back to where you were. That's it. Knee. May giri. Shiro giri and move forward a little bit and sun. May giri, shiro giri and back. Okay and nore. Nice, nice and that. And now we've just got a couple more from uh, Kibidach, just like in the previous grade we did Kibidach, we did Junski, Giramburai and Tetsui. Now this time we do some kicks from Kibidach. So keep it archi, so when you come down, just into juju key position. Keep it archi, juju ki yoi. Come out here. So again, we're going to do ura, exactly the same as that previous gray. This one comes around the back here, and then we step up with that front foot and do uh, yoko kiyagi. Side. Uh, no, side straight uh, stretching kick. Ready? And itch. That's it, and move back, that's it, and knee, back foot comes around, up, there, and back, sun, around, step up, there, and back, kaitanura, so we're going to come around this way now, and itch, now the front leg does it, doing every, always doing the kick to the front, knee, front foot goes that way, sun, And the next one we're going to do is Yoko Giri. Okay, exactly the same movement, but uh, no side kick. Yoko Giri means side kick. Ready? And itch. Round, come up. Yoko Giri. Knee. Sun. Kaitan Ura. So this foot is going to go that way. Itch. Knee. Just move down that way a little bit. And sun. And the last one of this set we're going to do is May Giri, um, is uh, Shiro Giri, sorry. Shiro Giri. Shiro Giri. Shiro is the back, so it's a back kick. Giri's kick. Okay. So we're going to come around, so this one here, she's going to come around Ura, so this foot's going to come around here. Once, it, once, uh, once she's brought it around, she's going to step up, look at this way, she's going to kick to the back and then go back down to that. Ready? And itch, so come all the way around, step up, do a back kick, and back down. Knee all the way around, step up, back kick, and down. And sun, step up, back kick, and down. And kaitan ura, just going to watch this one, and itch, around, step up, kick, and back where you are. Knee, step up, kick, and back to where you are. And sun, step up, kick. <laughs> And back to where we <laughs> And now we're going to finish off and we'll see if, see if Samara goes the correct direction here. And Nore. Yes, well done. And she can't wear the right Because remember when she went into the stance, she went back into it like this. So when she comes out, she goes the opposite direction. Well done. So now uh, we've got uh, uh, the carters to do. Okay, so. The kata is two katas, but this is a full on, ah, no, sorry, there's some more eta geckles to do first. It's a full on grade, this one. Green bout is the first real full on grade. From now on, all the bouts require a lot more work, 
you've put a lot of, you've put probably uh, two or three years into it so far, and so you should be getting pretty good and be able to pick up these things pretty, pretty well. So um, it takes a little bit more work. Everything starts getting harder from this point. So the next one we're going to do is, uh, is uh, what we call uke waza. Uke, uh, um, well, it actually doesn't translate to blocking, but uh, we'll say that for now that uke translates to blocking, which it doesn't. But so it's uh, blocking techniques. Uke waza. Okay. Uke actually means to receive. So. Uh, uh, okay, well, yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, so let's have a look at this one. So this one here, like I said, like I said, this one is a everything is a continuation from the last uh, from previous grades. So we've already learned Jodanuke, we've learned Sotuke, we've learned Uchuke, and we've learned Gidamarai. Now we have to put them forward in a in a sequence of events. So basically it goes goes like this so we step forward and we do all the all the, the those techniques jodenuke sotuke uchuke gidamburai and then do a gyakuski at the end um, so that was all with one hand with the same hand that's the leg is full the next one we're going to do it from the top but we're going to alternate each hands jodenuke sotuke uchuke gidamburai gyakuski uh, oiski okay Oi, oi meanings it's, it's coming off that front leg and the front arm. So now we do that same one, but with one arm, but from the bottom, but we go the opposite direction. So, Gidambarai, uh, Uchuke, Sotuke, other hand, Jodanuke, Gyakuske. So that was meant to be all with the same hand. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, with all the load ups. Load ups are important. You don't just bring one hand and do this, okay? Everyone has to have a load up. Now when we turn, she's doing, going to do all those techniques from the bottom, but with both hands. Are they leaning forward? One, two, three, four, five. And itch. Knee. Alternating hands from the top. Now one hand from the bottom. Carry on. Get up right. Uchuke. Sotuke. Jodenuke. Gakuski. And my wate. Both hands from the bottom, but using alternating hands. So you know if you've got the you've got the technique right because the last when you're doing it with alternating hands, it's an oiski. And when you're doing it with the one hand, it's a gyakuski. Okay? Um, we'll just go through it one more time, just with a straight count, ready, and itch. Knee. San. Mawate. Itch. San Mabote and Lore Earth and Yasuma. Well done, very good. Samara's got very good technique. I really like her, like his, the strength of his stance and her technique. Okay, and there's one more Irigeko to do, and that is fourth cure in Raku. So this one here is an important one to learn, because both these techniques uh, you have to uh, prove when you're doing your black belt, it's part of the black belt uh, curricul curriculum. Okay, so this is one that you have to make sure you know all the way through. So anyway, Zinko Tadachi, Juju Uki Yoi, Kamai Te Up. Just hands down this position here. So this one here is fourth cune raku. So we're just going to step it through slowly. So itch coming forward. So it's a double, that's called a Moroto Jodanski. And then two handed punch, Jagiran, and just slow down and Shudan. So then this, this leg is forward, 
So now we're going to do some oi ski. So that one draws back and now it punches to the head. Bang. Put it like that. And now it draws back again. The other one just comes out. This one has to just come out because you don't want to be punching like this because it's always one hand uh, pulls back the other one. And knee down, pull back, sun. And now it's Joe Nuke. Get number right. And here's a giddy, may get me. Knee kick, front kick, and down. Okay, so we'll just do that one more. Ready? Just slowly. Just I'll, I'll tell you when to do each one. And itch. So head, bottom, middle. So this time, this leg's forward, so that hand draws back. And head punch, back, middle, bottom punch, middle punch. And Joe Nuke with that front hand. Get under eye, he's a giddy, and may giddy. Notice when she did the he's a giddy, her hands come back into this position, didn't stay in this position here. Once she did the he's a giddy, the hands come back in here into that position here. Okay, this last time we're to go a little bit faster with it, just go in your own time and itch. So as you see, she went up because she, she actually did uh, Jodan and then she did Shudan twice. But it's Jodan, Gidan and Shudan. The Gidan ski goes, it's not going for the groin, it's going for the bladder. So it's around about bladder height. So when you really want to go to toilet with somebody and somebody gives you a hit in there, that's got a really bad, have a bad effect. Or if you get hit in the bladder, it will have a bad effect at any time. Okay. Okay, so now we'll start it again. So it's just, uh, and then we'll go through it. Again, ready, and that's it, coming forward, and itch. That's it, knee. Notice the load ups when she does the Jodanuki get number eye. And son. And my water again, and come over here, dog. <laughs> come here, and itch. Knee. something just something that I know people struggle with when they are doing this technique so as, they, as you're coming through uh, what they tend to do is go and then when they do their punches it's uh, they get it mixed up with this one so you've got to punch and leave when you're doing this one here punch leave it out there for a sec and then redraw punch withdraw so the withdrawal is slower than the punch so if we're doing the punch and we go Go like this. You don't know which hand is punching, so it's punch, bang, you hit it, and then you hold it. And then you come back, and then bang, you hit it, then hold it. Bang, hit it. So it's like three separate techniques. You're not doing sort of like uh, from here going, it's bang, hold, bang, hold, bang, hold, okay? And then with your he's a giddy and my giddy. Um, okay, so that was good. And so that's all the yeti geckles for this. So as I say, it was pretty full on. So um, the next one, last one, uh, oh, the next thing we're going to do is the cutters. Okay, so again, so let's do cutters. So this one here is Pinan Sonago. Okay, and Pinan Sonago. Yoi. And itch. Knee. Sun. 
chase. Go. Rook. That's it. It's a little bit there, wider there. Sitch. Hutch. So with this one here, just bring it, leave it a little bit further forward. Okay. Don't go come all the way back. The hand, this hand should be sort of like in front of you as it comes here. And then hutch. Still for a punch. Cool. Hands the key eye there. Joe. Under and looking that way. And the back hand is closed. Okay. And itch. Round kick the leg. <laughs> kick your back foot. That's it. Boom. So just come back and do that bit again, Samara. So from here, it comes up. We try to leave your hand where it is. Try not to drop your hand for your foot. Unless you obviously you can't, haven't got the stretch. But from here, yeah, your foot comes up and reaches the hand. So then, bang, and then strike here. And then we're coming up into this position here. So it's like, don't forget, there's a, so do it again. So put the arm out and itch. There, strike and up. Okay, knee. So that you're looking over that way, you lift your arms. And son. Just just do that again because you did a, you did an extra move there. Because I, I worked back. Um. Okay, so there and itch. So put your foot. So just go back again. So we'll just do this one again, so because so, it's a bit confusing from what I can see. So we're here like this. And then itch, we step out, oh, we look gosh. this way, and we put the hand up. And then from here, we strike down. We don't go too low, but you try to not be over with yourself like this. We're down in this position like that. Okay. And itch. Knee. Just move over this way a little bit. Sun. Around 45 that way. So this one here, the hand is facing upwards like this, and this one here is facing there, and strike, pitch, again. So this one here, notice that the arm is in that direction, that, in direct, that direction. So it's not down here, it's above the head. So bent arm, but above the head. And hutch, go, move out. And so we're moving out at 45 degrees, probably a little bit further this way, that's it. And jo. And then Nore standing up and Yasume. Let's do that one more time. And Pinan Sonago Yoi. Itch. Ni ni. San. She. Go. Rook. Sitch. Hutch. Ko. Joe. Itch. Knee. Sun. She. Go. The key on it. Rook. Sitch. Hutch. Go. Joe. And all right. No key there. So there's no key on the end there. But there's a key eye when you're coming down and do this technique here. Okay. Oh, it's well done, Samara. And there's one more uh, card for this grade. As I said, it's a big grade. And that is Skino. Okay. So let's have a look. Skino. Ready. And so that's stepping, stepping back here. Back, back. Okay, ready. Right leg goes back first. And we start this one with Moksu. Just watch out for the dog. I do not yeah, Moksu. So she closes her eyes. As soon as I name the name of the carter, she will open her eyes. Skino. Yoi. And itch. So she step 45 degrees and keep it out. So her feet should be parallel. And yeah. knee, stepping forward and punch. So from that stance, this foot just comes straight over here. It doesn't come in and out. Okay, you want to take the most direct path. She. Go. Rook, stepping out. Sitch. 
So next technique, this foot comes up and then we step over into Sanchin. Punch and punch. So that's the in the count, it's Uchuke, punch all in one count. Punch, move forward, ku, inke uchuke, ju, double punch. Itch, stepping forward, head punch. Knee, san, chi, front kick, and punch. Go, around, so this here has got another move. Hutch. Um, yeah, that'll do. I think the backhand is meant to be open here. Hutch. Cool. Joe. Shut. Itch. So when she stepped up, this foot remained at the front. So still at the front. And then not a. And Yasmin. Nice. Nice. Okay, we'll do that one more time. And. Pina. No. Moxo. Skino. Go. Itch. Knee. Sun. Shape. Go. Go. Sitch, hutch, co, double pat, and kick, Joe, double punch, itch, knee, sun, chi, notice how she had her hands under control there, they weren't waving around when she changed direction, two techniques in this one, go, rook, sitch, Hutch, go, shut, Joe, Nore, and Yasmin. First, well done. Okay, so now we're going to go through, and the last uh, thing that I want to show for this grade is the Ippons. So uh, we've got some preset Ippon committees. So um, what we'll do is um, I'll be We'll show it first, we'll first we'll show it uh, just with no uh, com uh, opponent and then we'll show it with a com uh, opponent. Okay, so let's have a look. So number one, so we're always starting in, in this position here. So number one is we step out, push across and strike. Do it again and itch, punch, step across, strike. Okay, and back again. So now we'll show it down here. So from here, I step through it with a head punch. Itch, bang, she punches me there, pushes across, and then strike to the neck. So she's got good distancing here, and strike strike me exactly right. This, one more time. And itch. So the movement to the side made my punch miss, so it's a little bit like a, a, a weaving your head. Okay, now number two. Number two, we, from here we step through, step through with, a, with our left leg, Jodanuke, punch, you leave your hand up there, grab behind the head and knee. So ready, and itch, punch, knee, and then back. Again, one more, and knee, not eight. and now we'll do it with, um, we'll do it, this one here is a bit harder to get the distancing, but you have to so somehow do it, so we need to be at the right, so uke, like me, I'm called uke, stay where you are, it needs to be able to come, and the punch needs to be in that right position there. So she needs to be in that position and not too far back. Ready? And itch. Sure. Nice. Again. And knee. Sure. And all right. Nice. Go number three. 
Uh, that brings us to Sion, and Sion is from here. We're going to step across and push the strike away. We're going to uh, strike and strike. Is that Sion? Oh, is that what we're just doing? Go on. Yeah, that's Sion. Yeah, that's Sion. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. what we're just doing. Yeah. Okay, ready? There was a bit of confusion because the, the video player some, for some reason turned off. But we're going to carry on from there. And ready, so we do it in the air and start. Strike. Strike. So we're striking here, striking to the neck, striking with the elbow. And start. Strike. Strike to the neck, strike with the elbow. Okay. okay. Notice the good stances, and when we do this in pairs, we also have to keep that, maintain that good stance, okay? I'll, I'll swap over, I feel like it's better on the side. Like, no, no, but... Uh, but they can see it oh, okay. on the side for this one. Okay, then, okay, them. ready? So again, like I said before, don't move from here. No, no, don't move. So we need to be able to uh, strike, stay where you are, to, so that, that you're in this position. We don't, we don't want to be striking out here. person won't need to, we need to be in this position here. So ready and start. Struck in the hand, striking to the neck, striking with the elbow. And down again. Ready and start. There. Strike. Strike. Notice the good stance. She's she's very well balanced in her stance and her techniques are very well. And all right. Notice. Okay. And so number four. Yon. Okay, so number four is from here, we step out, the punch is coming forward here, we step, move, and then from here, once we've done the punch, this hand just comes up, blocks, and strikes at the same time. Okay, ready, and yon, strike, strike, one more, yon, strike, strike, okay. And all day. So we'll do it in pairs now. We'll do it that way. Do it, do it that way. Yeah. yeah. So again, from here, so don't move. We make sure that the, 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 the your that your punch is in that right position. Ready? And yon. And back. Okay. Ready? Same thing. And yon. There. Yeah. So when you're punching, so just do that very first move, that's all. Ready? I'm punching, I'm striking to where her head was, because she's now moved her head. Okay, and push the arm away, and strike. Okay, it's a simultaneous move. And my feet. Yeah, so the feet, look at this, then kutsudachi that way, then kutsudachi that way. Okay, so it's like, do that again, so just come over here and do that. So she's in this position, and... Hi. So punch she up. punches, twisting, okay, so she's in, do it again, she's in Zenkutsudachi this way, then Zenkutsudachi that way, that's, again, good traditional strong stances, uh, and that's what we're looking for in this one, and the last one for this grade is number five, so for that, this one here, you step back with the right leg to miss the miss the uh, the techniques coming here to you here you just step back enough to miss the technique you don't want to jump back too far okay and then it's Megiri Jodan Gira oh no sorry <laughs> sorry step back Jodanuke and then it's Gyaku Jodanuke to push the hand up and then head punch middle punch Okay, so we'll do that again, ready, step back, kick, jodanuke, hit, shudan, 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 ready? No, you're not, why, why, I usually step back, like this, okay. or is it just? I would say just move, I would say move this, it's like if you're fighting and somebody, if you had to punch me here in the, in the head, all I want to do is just move back enough to actually come back into it. I don't want to move my whole body because then I have to step all the way forward. So move and bang, basically exactly the same. So ready and itch, back, kick, again ready and itch, there, kick, and 
Okay, so again, so we move back, we do on the kick, we step into Zenkutsurachi to do the Jodanuke head and middle punch. This. So we'll do it from this side again. I just, we'll just go out this way a little bit. So again, so if I had to do the punch there, so she needs to just move back enough to miss the miss the punch yes. and get the kick in. Ready? Is it head kick? Uh, middle section kick. So it's a shoot on, shoot on, uh, make it. Okay, and itch. That's it. One, one, two. Back. Again, here. Itch. Kick. One, two. And all right. And yes, no. Uh, so thank you very much, Samara. You did really well. Well, I hope you think.